friends, today is Tuesday, May 2nd, 2017, and I have yet another unboxing for you. I went ahead and I took the tape off of this box here because I didn't want you to have to watch me struggle with it, but I did not look inside. So this comes from Ansi Labs, A-N-T-S-Y, Labs, two separate words. And I went ahead and I got a, it's called a fidget cube. And it's right here in this little bubble wrap. And I also have the keychain that comes with, well, that you can buy with it. So I'll go ahead and show you both. I'll show you the cube first. <laughs> it's got the tag, Fidget Fever. Focus. Funny, the camera had to focus because that's the purpose of this cube is to help you focus and uh, I bought it because well I have ADD and I have trouble focusing and I get fidgety and this that and the other so it comes in a little plastic box here that's really cool it's uh if you want to display it when you're not using it you can so you just uh, peel the tape off first <laughs> so that is pretty slick. I like it. Fidget Cube by Ansi Labs is what the box says. So mine's all black. I didn't want it to look like a toy, so I just bought the black variety. And it looks like a little, um, just like a little gadget. So they secured it with a plastic little thingy here. And it comes with a bag that you can slide your fidget cube into when you're not using it so that's pretty slick so I'll set this aside and I'll set the bag aside and I'll attempt to un attach this without causing any damage I don't know how this is done but uh I'll go ahead and tug and if it proves to be, oh, there it is. They glued it on there. Okay, that's cool. And they have the little sticky tape here. So I'll just go ahead and peel that off and I'll show you the cube. I don't know. Yeah, there we go. It's coming, you guys. So anyway, I bought this because I, I'm i always fidgeting. I mean, I'm forever constantly moving. I mean, not like my whole body, but usually like my fingers or something, I'm always like, I don't know, tapping something or playing with something or... Anywho, I got the tape off and I'll set the little plastic display thing down. And this is the cube, you guys. This is the... Um, the switch. This is the thing you can just kind of roll like a mouse. And you've got some slidey thingies. Kind of like a, what you see on the back of a computer mouse. And then you've got this here that you can just kind of slide around with your finger. You've got, okay, that's the switch. Um, let's see. This here looks like, um, just buttons that you can click. There's, uh, these two, I believe, actually make the sound, and these three here don't. Uh, that middle one does. But these two don't. This one on the corner, and this one on the corner. And this has a little dent that you can use to just kind of slot your finger around if you like that kind of texture. This here has a little wheel that you can turn, makes a little sound. Uh, I think I might have showed you everything this has. Let me see. Should have six sides. Um, yeah, so you have you have a a choice basically. If you want to make sound, like if you're if you're in a meeting and you're like fidgety, you can just kind of like nonchalantly 
like fidget <laughs> but there's options you don't have to like make sounds to be destructive during the meeting you can just like use your ball here it doesn't make any sound you can use this little slidey thing here it doesn't make any sound this little dent here makes no sound and I believe you could even somehow I don't know if you can program the other things to I don't think you can but anyway I like it it feels um, heavy duty this little clicker thing this little switch like a light switch makes makes sound so yeah if you like the clicky sound then I uh, live your life <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll probably be using it because I like it I like the clicky sound I like the way it feels when I click it so like when I'm kicking back watching YouTube I'll probably be using this and sliding things and I love it you guys it fits in the palm of my hand so I can just like turn it use it so yeah anywho uh, that is the fidget cube from ANSI labs I'll go ahead and link them below so if you want to go ahead and get your own you can choose from a different variety of colors and I don't want to forget about the little keychain that goes on it um, Mine is, it should be black. In fact, it is. I can see it right here. And uh, you can pretty much attach it to anything that allows for a keychain. So this is it. This is, it's called a prism. Oh, I want to show you the bag before I show you. It's really cute. It says ANSI Labs. ANSI Labs. So I'm going to need to figure out how this goes on and I'm going to try to do it on camera so you guys can see. So what, what you want to do is you want to make sure that the keychain is not wound up to any of these sides like mine was. So you just want to make sure that it's hanging right off the corner. Just like that. And I think what you do is you take it the opposite corner and you just slide your cube. Um, you're going to have to stretch some of these things. Yay! I did it! I did it! Okay, that's my prism cube, you guys. It's inside the prism. My fidget cube. And everything is intact. Nothing's torn. That's going to be in my video. Please like, comment, subscribe, share. Um, all that good stuff. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, you guys. And I will see you on the flip. Bye-bye.